over and welcome back to my channel. I'm joined with Tracy, Hi. aka Totally Music. Um, and because it's near Christmas, we're going to do a Christmas quiz. We've got 10 questions that we found on Google, so no one, none of us know the answers until you get to the bottom of the page. Um, so we're just going to see who wins, basically. So let's get started. So, number one is according to the poem, The Night Before Christmas. How many reindeer did Santa have to pull his sleigh? Eight, nine or ten? I've not seen that in ages. I'm just guessing. Me too. No idea. Number two is what is traditionally tra traditionally hidden inside a Christmas pudding. I don't even know the answer to this one. I do. <laughs> I think I do, but it might be a stupid answer. It's snowing. Is it? It's not it's raining. Can you not see it? No, it's like snow and rain. rain to me. I might be making it. Why are you like making I'm writing, all the, I'm writing all the numbers down. Oh, I thought that was still an answer. No, I did my answer ages ago. I was like, what? Number three is, what is the name of the character in Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol who is visited by ghosts of Christmas past, present and future? I don't know how to spell it. Well, it's not does it? <laughs> I guess it's spelling. But I know what it says. I've got a big line down my face of sun. <laughs> oh, no. Number four is... Oh. I don't know if we're going to know this one. Mm -hmm. A foreign city has donated a huge Christmas tree to the people of Britain every year since... 1947, which is always displayed in Trafalgar Square. Which city is it? A. Munich, B. Stockholm, oh, yeah, Stockholm. or C. Oslo. Oslo. I'm guessing. I made a guess as well. Didn't know we haven't got a Christmas tree done yet. Neither did I. Number five is how many days are there on a the traditional advent calendar? 12, 24, or 31? Number six is in the song The Twelve Days of Christmas, how many gold rings does the singer's true love give him? That's easy. <laughs> hey, you even wrote that down before the question <laughs> even finished. Number seven. Weren't I? There are 365 days in a year. What number day is Christmas Day? God. Does it give you options? No. There's 365. There's how many? 365, I think I've got it. I think I've got it as well. I think, if my maths are right. Yeah, that's what I mean, <laughs> if my maths are right, I've got it too. Number eight is, why did Father Christmas need Rudolph the reindeer to use his large glowing nose to guide his sleigh? It's just told you in the question. No, it doesn't. Why did Rudolph, why did Rudolph, why did Father Christmas need Rudolph the reindeer to use his large glowing nose to guide his sleigh? To guide his sleigh? Yeah. <laughs> why did he need him to guide his sleigh? <laughs> What's the reason? Daft, I know, but it pretty much told you to guide his sleigh. <laughs> well, that's not the answer. I know it's not the answer, but I'm, I was joking. Flipping heck. No, you changed it into no, a I joke because you realised. No, I didn't. No, I was writing it down. <laughs> Number nine is what is the last day of Christmas called? Do you not? No. <laughs> Christmas day? <laughs> what is the last day of Christmas called? Why are you writing a <laughs> list? Do you know it? No. <laughs> I didn't know there was one. Oh, got a reminder. Yeah. Number 10, which plant beginning with P is associated with Christmas? Oh, no, but I don't know how you spell it. Is it obvious? No, well, I don't think, well, you might have heard more mention it. The only thing I know is a mistletoe. <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, it's not beginning with a P. I know it's not. <laughs> I don't even know a plant that begins with a P apart from a poppy. <laughs> oh, wait. I don't know if I've spelled it right, though. It's not a plant, though. Give me a clue. No! <laughs> I don't know. I literally don't know. Okay. I guess. I can't even guess because I don't even know anything apart from a poppy and you know it's not poppy. Your pansy has got a P in it. I did. Well, I did forgot about the name Pansy. <laughs> I don't know. I'll leave it blank. Okay, so we've done our ten and we're just going to swap papers. <laughs> oh, was it? Oh, I didn't know that. And now I'm going to scroll down to the answers. Right, so number one, which was, according to the poem, The Night Before Christmas, how many reindeers did Santa have to fully slay? Eight, nine, or ten? Tracy put nine. You put eight. And the answer was eight. I, was like, I had a feeling it might have been, but... Oh, I definitely got this one wrong. So, number two... A Christmas pudding one. Which is what is traditionally hidden inside a Christmas pudding? <laughs> Sarah put a ring <laughs> and Tracy put coin stroke money and the answer was a coin. Ooh. <laughs> so, number three, which was what is the name of the character in Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol who is who gets visited by ghosts of Christmas past, present, and future? Now, what do I do with this? Because Tracy put Scrooge. And you put Ebenezer Scrooge, it's the same person. But it says Ebenezer Scrooge. Well, it's still Scrooge. Do I give her a full point? I have a point. No, you a full point. <laughs> it didn't say full name. I'm glad you knew what it said. It's right, isn't it? No. No. It's like Sneezer. Ebenezer. Uh, right, number four. A foreign city has donated a huge Christmas tree to the people of Britain every year since 1947, which is always displayed in Trafalgar Square. Which city is it? A. Munich, B. Stockholm, R. C. Oslo. Tracy put Oslo. And Sarah put Munich. This would probably Oh my god, you now. was right. Was it? <laughs> I was a guess. Oslo. <laughs> I've kind of heard of it, I think, when I thought about it. Mm -hmm. Number five is how many, cal how many days are there on a traditional advent calendar? 12, 24 or 31? Tracy put 24. Oh, did you? And it's 24. We both know this next one, right? <laughs> Number six is in the song, 12 Days of Christmas, how many gold rings does the singer's true love give him? I don't even need to scroll down for five. the <laughs> Five gold rings. Um, we both put five, I guess. Um, yes, we did. Number seven was, there are 365 days in a year, what number is Christmas Day? Tracy I think we've both got this wrong. Why? Because I think I've just worked it out and we've... Is it a trick question? No. I think it, we've both put 359, but I actually think it's 358 now, I've just thought about it. Why? I don't know. What number was it? Seven. Seven. 359! Alright, oh, okay. Yes. I'm thinking, because I was thinking maybe I didn't take one off for Christmas Day, but... Um. well I... No, because it was Christmas yeah, Day's number. Number eight was, why did Father Christmas need Rudolph the reindeer to use his large glowing nose to guide his sleigh? It was foggy. Tracy put to see in the fog. Where did you put see his fog? <laughs> it was foggy see. on Christmas Eve, that's yeah, technically yeah. right. I was going to put see his way in the fog, but it was too long oh. to write, so. Um, number nine. What is the last day of Christmas called? You've put the last day of Christmas, lol. <laughs> Which is clearly not right. And Tracy put Christmas Day. My logic was, there's 12 days of Christmas, and so the last day is Christmas Day. What number was it? Nine. Nine? Twelfth night. Oh, okay. We both got that one wrong. I think we're drawing. Oh, no. No, you're winning. I've oh, got two wrong, you've right. got one. Well, I've got three wrong no. now, you've got two. And I definitely got this one wrong. <laughs> so you've 100% won anyway. Um, what did you just do? <laughs> <laughs> Don't trust her. Number ten, which was the last question, was which plan began, beginning with P, is associated with Christmas? I thought Pansettia. I didn't put anything. Is that yeah? That's not yeah, yeah. it. How did you know that? I've never heard of that. Mum mentions it. <laughs> I've never heard of it before. Obviously, Tracy won. Sarah got six out of ten. Oh, Tracy eight. got eight. Hey, come on. 
Uh -huh. I don't know how she can win on my own channel. <laughs> Why are you mean piece of paper? Because I am. So that is it. That is the end of this video. <laughs> I won. <laughs> Tracy won. Um, if you joined in, let us know down in the comments below how many questions you got right and see if you beat any of us two. And no cheating. Don't wait till the end. <laughs> um, thank you, Tracy, for joining me today. Okay. And yeah, I'll see you next week for another video. Bye. Bye.